Welcome to Train Signal. I'm Ross Pagertis. In this video, we'll be covering variable length subnet masking, or VLSM. Now, VLSM is more traditionally called just subnetting. It's the type of subnetting we use in our regular everyday networks. The idea here is that the length of our subnet mask can vary. <laughs> How's that for reiterating what the title of my video is here? What we did in the past with subnetting in the lessons so far is we figured out how to calculate different subnetworks from a larger network address that's given to us by our ISP by simply dividing it up into equivalent number of hosts per network for a finite set of networks. So we said that network requirements were 8 networks or 16 networks or 500 networks. And then we assume that every number of all the hosts on each of those networks were identical. In variable length subnet masking, we take a different approach to that, and that is, instead of figuring out what our needs are from the number of networks perspective, we actually tackle the problem from the number of hosts perspective. 